Hello YouTube, Ludwig here, and today we are back for another episode or another video of Trains at Drive It 2. We are back on the Roseburg Valley, well, Roseburg Valve Railway, um, because we are here to test out, uh, to actually test drive. Uh, let me just switch back the inside view. Uh, to test drive my uh, very first reskin uh, train on train Z, uh, LNERP2. Uh, this LNERP2 is uh, number 2008, number 8, uh, 8P2. William Wallace is a fictional, is a fictional variant or fictional P2, which you know is, it, it, is, it, 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 it exists in uh, Railways of Roseworth. And uh, yeah. With permission from uh, EDH6, uh, I was able to make this reskin possible, and with along with uh, a corona tender made from uh, I think an Elenia Gress no, Gre yeah Elenia Gressley A3 1928 tender, and this is uh, modified or reskin from uh, Elenia Gressley P2 2001 Cock Older North. So uh, yeah, I managed to make it. At first, it was pretty complex. Uh, when making this reskin, but at last I was able to do it with the help of it, with the help of him as well. And uh, yeah, I'll give you a quick surprise once we reach the end of the video. And also, originally I was hoping to do a train set race between uh, Elenia P2 and the actual Polar Express locomotive. However, uh, for some reason, the model when I tried recording it, the model just doesn't work. Like no no it works, however, um, it just keep crashing my game. So I just gave up and decided to change to plan B. We just drive it. We just just simply test driving the P two. I know it is like not as, uh, you know, not as uh, amazing or exciting as simply driving it, but it's better than nothing. And yeah, today is uh, 16th of 12, uh, 16th of December 2022. It is also my birthday, so I the train is equipped with Pullman carriages instead of uh, Oriental Express carriages because uh, the actual uh, Oriental Express carriages is locked. Sadly, is locked behind a DLC, which I haven't, which I didn't brought. Wow, yeah, I had brought like one or more A4, which is this one. We'll get back to you later on, uh, but yeah, this is the consist. Uh, and because I picked the Pullman carriages because it fits the theme, the UK theme, I guess. And uh, yeah, on the and I do have a more like actually accurate Oriental Express carriages, like comp like counterpart to real life. But again, it doesn't really fit with the UK theme here, so that's why I picked the Pullman carriages instead as the birthday train consist. And uh, yeah, without further ado, let's close our doors. Let's do this. Close both sides. And uh, yeah, we should be able to get to go. The lights should turn off somehow. Uh, let me just close the doors again, if that's possible. I don't know why the lights just turned on. The, the I, I, I did not expect this. I think the, I think the train bugged. <laughs> yeah, I think the train bug. Hang on. Okay, uh, concert specs. I just had to spawn in another one. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, without further ado, with uh, this point set, uh, let's depart. And I also, speaking of departure, I should have the command ready to go. Here's a shot. Okay, uh, let me go to the command. Oh, yeah, yeah, stop driving. <laughs> uh, so, let me go to play sound for guard whistle. There we go. The guard whistle has, the guard whistle's blown, and uh, let's go.
Bye. And uh, one more thing as we depart out of uh, Lofel, I believe. Yeah, Lofel. I just downloaded this uh, Rose map, Rose Earth map, like in like just absolutely just immediately because um, it was urgent. Again, I did not expect this to be Plan B at all. And again, it's for the birthday round. Birthday train is behind here, and uh, yeah. And so our this one will be only going to all the way, all the way over to uh, Arendelle. We just we'll just reach here, and this is our end of the video. This is where we end the video, and and our journey. Our top speed would be our top speed for the P two is ninety four miles miles per hour. Um, it's because of the engine spec. Basically, the engine spec is what, like, I don't know, like the engine, I believe it's the engine sound, like, as you can see, the puffing, uh, the puffing sounds, and uh, accelerating and speed, which is where you have to deal with that in the engine spec's configuration. And, uh, yeah, that's what the, com what the comic is. And, uh, yeah, to compare to real like, counterpart, this LNR uh, P2's max speed is... 70 miles per hour, uh, but the train set, aka the uh, creator who made these uh, LN, this LNR P2 models, uh, aka uh, EDH6, I believe, yeah, EDH6, hopefully I didn't uh, get, got the name incorrect, <laughs> and uh, yeah, they set the speed to 94 miles per hour, which we we're gonna try and reach today, before we reach Armandale. Look at how magnificent this reskin is. My fictional piece of actually running. On, like, in train set. And yeah, this is, uh, again, I'm running this on uh, train, set rail train set railroad simulator 2022, which is like, currently, as of I'm recording this video, uh, the, l the latest and newest version of train set. I think it's, I heard it's still in beta, but yeah. I decided to buy anyways because it's the newest thing and I don't want to buy like 2009, 2019 otherwise I'm gonna have to buy another game already. And we are passing uh, Applesway. Applesway. 74 miles per hour at the moment. And yeah, along the way I also randomly placed, this, uh, placed some trains down. There is an LMS Duchess in black livery. There are two G or panniers over there. And uh yeah. You want let's review the quantas really quick then shall we? So let me open up the this thingy here and then go into uh train car names. So we got uh K Pullman K break third uh third class Pullman K Power first Pullman nineteen fifty one bar Pullman 5B, uh, 5B, L, or Bell, uh, Kitchen first, Pullman K, Parlor first, another one, and last, Pullman Observation Car, Devon Bell. So, uh, yeah, sadly, uh, these carriages, these Pullman carriages does, do not have any sort of interior view, as you can see, if we just pop it, then, yeah, that's, then, like, this is the cab. Of the LNR P2, it uses the same as the LNR A3, basically. It's the default one as well, and there's a freight train. We're pressing a high cracks. For some reason, this version of the map doesn't have this platform. I don't know why. Anyways, yeah, um, we can also change view, which is something you can do only or exclusively on like trains and PC. You can't do this on like uh, trains and mobile. So that's kind of sad, honestly. Yeah, you can drive along. So you can see our nameplates. There's a back view as well. You can see the back of our train. And uh, we're back to the first view. And again, uh, these Pullman carriages does do not have interior, but they do have actual interior inside, just not the interior view. And I just randomly spawned in 
the names, like the spawn in the pulling carriers, so the names are random. What we what wait, what do we got? Uh car number 80. Uh Ursula? Ursula, yeah, I think Ursula. Uh Pegasus. Uh Mona? Agatha. And of course the the, the Devon Bell itself. And yeah, that's the whole concept really. Get rid of train down names, and we are passing uh I've wrong station, I think. I I don't I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't know how to pronounce this. Oh trains. But uh yeah. And we have finally reached um, 94 miles per hour or uh 151 uh kilometers per hour. This is the top speed of for train sets uh LNERP2. Again, I haven't set or uh, modified uh the speed of the LNERP2, so yeah. Oh, we're crossing the bridge, actually, wait, wait, wait. And also, we can actually pause. Like, yeah, you can do that uh, same on the uh, trains at mobile, or like, trains that are mobiles. But, uh, on trains that are uh, on PC, mainly, uh, you, when you pause, you can just, uh, like, play with the controls as well, still, or, like, uh, press the horn. Something like that, yeah. And, uh, let me do, so I can take a, take a I want to take a good screenshot, actually. Since we are already like fast approaching, uh, we're fast approaching. Uh, where, where, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah. Uh, wait, no, that's not, yeah. We're we're very close approaching Avondale. Avondale. I don't know that uh, that pronounce it correctly. <laughs> Let me just ah, perfect. Absolutely perfect. Okay, three, two, one. Yes. Honestly, I think I should have. Um. Oops. Then I mean to press the edit. In. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like maybe we should. Uh, we could have just um put more like one more carriages because uh put the pooping carriages are way shorter than the Orient Express ones that I used in Trains of Java Two. So uh, but maybe I'll add one coach in the future. Or maybe next year. Who knows? Uh, yeah. Uh, let me try and get a good views here as well, as the P two flies along, as Wallace flies along. Uh, also, with the William Wallace names came from an LNR uh P two as well, a, f a very old model, that is made by, um, uh, I believe that is made by Alex twenty three. So yeah. I I used it, that name in Rare Souls of Rosworth. I wish I could have used it, the name. So that's why I brought it, the William Wallace name, onto uh, here. Instead of some, something else. And, uh, okay, as we approach uh, Armandale, let's slow down. Because we are, I don't want to overshot. Yeah, I believe it's over, just, it's just over there. Let's just slow down, like, that's just idle, idle speed. Um, another thing is that, uh, Ludwig. Why do you pick um, a corridor tender instead of a non-corridor tender, which is what usually the, which is what usually uh, LNR P2 uses, even when it was in streamlined, when it was streamlined back then. So in the old model, or the model I used back on Trader Driver 2, aka Alex 23's LNR P2 model, it uses uh, the streamlined. Uh, and then your P2's is tender, which is for some reason a corridor tender, which is uh, I believe it's just a simple uh, A4 tender reskin, recolored. So I guess it just back then it just flapped it in and called it called it a day. So yeah, when I used it on Trader Java 2, I used it a non streamlined uh, uh, P2 and a uh, corridor tender. So to re to recreate that accuracy, uh, when making when making this reskin. I asked for permission when making the P2 as well. I specifically also asked for a corridor tender, so for me to for me to reskin. Uh, I, the only difference between the original one and this one is the stroke wheels. So yeah, I mean, it looks it, it it fits so well, so much better. Hell, I mean, in the old, old in the old model, 
uh, Nintendo uses a green disc wheel. So, it's kind of like the combine of a disc wheel, which is like plain black wheel, and it's like a green stroke wheel, which is this one. So, basically the colors, I guess. And, yeah, I think stroke wheel looks more prettier than, sim than a simple disc wheel. Uh, yeah, that's why I picked the stroke wheel for this tender. And I was ho I was gonna use like a streamlined tender because in the the two thousand and the two zero zero seven, aka the current P two that's being built in like in real life, uh, there is one version that is also in tr on train set where the tender I believe is uh crooked a little bit. It's like the streamlined bit is there, but it's like, like way smaller instead of very very big. Masali that's only limited to uh, 2007, so I decided to just go with this tender instead, which, this, which is what uh, EDH6 recommended me when reskinning uh, or like, trying to give a tender for my uh, to, to my uh, LNERP2 here. And yeah, again, top speed for the LNERP2 is 70 miles per hour. So I mean, if you want to follow the real life counterpart when of like real life speed when driving these. And I guess that's your answer. And there's an N class and a class 58 over there. And we have arrived at Armandale Station. Very fast, huh? Let me go to. Wait, let me pause so I can go to fly mode. This flying camera is so very useful. Like you can again, you can just fly around, but not as good as like when I try to do it with the parallel, uh, parallel shot because you know, flying camera can't keep, you know, keep itself on the track. So it's reasonable. And yeah, let's slow down. Oh no, oh no, oh no, stop, 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 stop! Stop! Well, as long as the carriage is on the platform, it's fine. Why is the wheel still spinning? There we go, it's stopped. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this is my test run, or, or I guess the official test run of the my reskinned uh, William Wallace fictional ver uh, fictional variant or fictional what's it called? I guess a fictional yeah I think it's a fictional P2 I guess I could call it that so um, yeah that's the, that's my very very short birthday run and uh, again reason why I want to just I have uh, yeah, I actually don't think I have mentioned why I just do it to Armandale and not like do a full loop all the way to uh, Malfam because uh, I get because of the train set race that I tried to do earlier because it kept, uh, like it kept crashing and I thought it was because of uh, either like my laptop doesn't have enough RAM or so I just just scared that the game would crash so that's why I just made it to halfway point here and uh, yeah again that is all for this run and Ludwig. You said there was a surprise for us, so what would that be? Well, let me just... I feel like I should do the interface view with this. I feel like this should be better. This is a better view. Okay, this can do. So... So guys, I have a surprise announcement for you guys. Because it's my birthday, as of I'm recording this video, a few days ago, I was able to upload uh, William Wallace, the P2, and its tender onto DLS, and it's currently getting approved. Uh, as uh, now, according to uh, the trains, hang on, let me let me check. And uh, now, according to tr uh, the DLS on the website, the DLS, it says that it's available soon. And it's currently unlisted as of I'm making this video. Maybe this once this video is out, the model should be available. But what about uh, people who wish to play this on mobile? Sadly, 
I don't think that's possible. However, for those who would, for those who are try, uh, who are playing, uh, this are uh, the playing trains that on Android devices. I have prepared a Google docu a Google file on the, in the description below. So if you wish to download uh, my William Wallace, feel free to you go to the Google Documents and download it from there, or you can just wait until the DLS version is out. And uh, yeah, feel free to drive my feel free to drive uh, an eighth member of the P two for completely free. I mean, well, unless Trainset decides to just uh, borrow this engine for a DLC to, you know, sell it on Trainset Driver 2. I mean, that'd be cool. I mean, I would be glad that it would be on a DLC, but who knows. Uh, but, I uh, yeah. Again, for those who wish to download, uh, who wish to try and drive the Alinea P2, uh, go to the Google Documents below and, uh, I shouldn't know. Sorry, not, sorry, not Google Documents, my bad. Google Drive! I leave a link to the Google Drive where you can download the LNER P2 and the tender. Uh, if you got, if it, if it has missing assets, um, please do let me know so I can uh, try and help uh, fix it. Uh, otherwise, uh, because currently this model S uh, on the DLS website, it says that, uh, sadly, it's only currently available for a Trainset Railroad Simulator 19 or uh, Trainset Railroad uh, Simulator uh, 2020. So basically, uh, it's for tra Trainset two, uh, two, uh, bleh, is currently only available for Trainset uh, 2019 or, or 2019 or for Trainset uh, 2020, which is uh, 2022, which is currently my version. I was hoping I I'm a try at, if it's possible. I'm a try and make. Uh, the LNR P2 to be more compatible with older versions of Trainset. I don't know is that even possible, but if I if I'm able to do that, then I will up I will upload a more updated version of the LNR P2 uh, onto DLS. So that's what my plan was gonna be if there's if if there's anything go wrong. So yeah, as of now, again, sadly to say, this model uh this P2 is currently only available on uh. Uh, 2019, a uh, train set to the, there. This is only a, currently available on uh, 20, uh, 20, train set 2019 or train set uh, 2022. 20, uh, so, for those who we, who don't, for those who have older version of train sets, I'm really sorry you aren't gonna be able to get this P2. You can probably still uh, use the older version of the P2. Older version of the P2, aka like Alex 23, so you can get a uh, William Wallace and uh, 2008. But yeah, so far that's the only way you can get uh, the same variant, I guess, William Wallace in 2008. And uh, for the Pullman characters, I believe you can download it from the DLS website as well, not uh, the uh, managed content from like the launcher. So, but yeah, again, well, that's all for today. Uh, wish me happy birthday, and for those who did wish me wish me happy birthday, thank you so much. I'm a very happy man. It really feels like hot. It just feels heartwarming. I don't know. It's not even the correct word. <laughs> so yeah, I'm 19 now, and uh, I guess subscribe and turn on the notification bell if you wish to see some more uh, train set videos coming up. I might do some more train set races if uh, the model doesn't crash my game. Uh, so if you want to see that or some more train set scenarios, um, subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss this video. And uh, like this vid and of course like this video for more train set videos to come if you liked it. I know it's been a while because the last video of a train set episode or even a train set race is just last year. So. Before I leave the UK, I think just, you know, give it my all. So, yeah. This is uh, William Mollis and then P2. And I'll uh, see you all in the next video then. Blue Dexter's Blue Dex, signing off. Peace out and... Goodbye. 
Have a nice day, everybody.